What's up guys and welcome back to another video. This video is going to be a lot more interesting than the normal ones I do because this is actually the random country challenge where it's pretty much we get like five turns to like pick a, to click on the random civilizations and whatever country you get you have to play as pretty much. You only get five five turns, you have, you're only allowed to switch five times. If you don't like a country then you can switch about another four times and keep doing that until you get a random one. And obviously you have to do the the country that gives you the last and i'm not gonna do this on the i'm gonna do this on the beginner fog of war is gonna be off but the ai aggressiveness is gonna be actually hmm yeah aggressive aggressiveness is gonna be on 400 percent and you know what might as well let's just stick it up to um stick it up to normal difficulty let's just leave it like this and uh yeah so that's that's it for now let's see what country we're gonna get obviously the first one doesn't count because i just started the game okay lithuania American Samoa, Bolivia, Ireland, and Kyrgyzstan. So that was about four times, I think. One, two, three, yeah. No, this is no. Okay, there we go. This is the fifth time. So yeah, we have to play Angola. So um, yeah, okay, here we go. And uh, yeah, sandbox mode is. Should I do this sandbox mode? No, I'm not gonna do this. I have to survive as long as possible, actually. All right, here we go. So um, this is gonna be a lot of fun. So we gotta. Um, Quickly put some of this in uh, economy, income taxation, production, administration, military upkeep, and a little bit of uh, research. There we go. Let's fix our taxes quite a little bit. So we're gonna bump the tax up to about this much. I'm gonna lower the goods back down over here. Investments can stay on the line, and then we wanna just put. Actually, we don't want any research just yet because we wanna make some money so we can. Like we can actually like you know afford a, a proper army. So yeah, obviously I put on 400. Oh yeah. Oh look at this Abyssinian. That's a new thing. There will be work breaking out at some point, but difficulty is on normal, so it's gonna be obviously normal. Not too crazy. But there's also gonna be a lot of uh, conflicts and wars and stuff like that. So um, first thing we have is Abyssinia forming. Oh, that, that's interesting. Alright, let's just, um, obviously we just want to survive as long as possible. We can also invade countries if you wish to, but we just kind of have to survive a little bit. We don't really have to, we can't really invade much if there's a huge... Okay, I think that's going to be my army for now. We can skip a lot of turns forward so we can get a little bit of money. Get a little bit more troops. I'm also gonna, um, hold on, let me see, I'm gonna have to, Bumpy, I'm gonna have to put a lot of this in research, so research, maximum research, so I'm not gonna get any money for this, yeah, well, this is going into research, so this should give me a bunch of points, okay, oh, this war's going on, whoa, what, Right, Libya is at war with Algeria, and the game is already lagging quite bad. There's a lot of wars going on. Germany just... Oh boy, Germany. Germany just annexed Austria very, very quickly as well. Switzerland and French. The French are just invading Belgium. Ukraine is at war with dumb fellas. This is completely normal. Just... Oh yeah, Moldova also doesn't exist. And yeah, Hungary, oh, as always, they won't always want revenge. And Germany wants to do German things. And then, uh, yeah, the Baltics are just cursed. And Turkey is getting beat up. Okay, um... I have to go back down over- where's my- where's my research, bro? Where are my research points at, eh? I feel like I'm not doing right- I feel like I'm not doing anything right here. Oh, yeah, right. My research is completely dead, actually, so... We gotta bump that up a little bit, and then I'm gonna... Lower the investments by a little bit. We wanna get the money back. The game is also running quite slow. I think it's because the amount of countries that I war with right now. All right, so let's set up a uh, let's set up a small army division around around some of these places. Not everywhere, just a few places, not too many. Let's set up like two thousand over here, and then we set like a very small army down over here south. We want to have army put in every single place, at least just to kind of protect us from the incoming enemy. The game is extremely laggy right now. 
it's not a good thing for me. Oh yeah, well that's that's awesome. Oh and uh, yeah. Poland and Ukraine having a go at it. Uh, Belarus is just doing some... What the hell is going on over here? Russia, are you doing... Okay, Russia just... I next Estonia. That's, that's actually nice. Uzbeks are work with dumb fellas, and dumb fellas are work with dumb, and then, uh, yeah, Pakistan's doing their own thing. Afghanistan's actually invading China, wow. Burma is a huge mess right now, and then uh, South Korea is invading the North. Canada and the US having a war. Uh, yeah, and then both, oh uh, yeah, the all Belo Peruvian Confederation. Why is that Ron in Arabia? What the fuck? And I'm losing money, oh, okay. Hold on, I'm, I'm losing money, hold on. Fellas, could you, okay, I don't know, okay, I'm just gonna declare, like, just declare war on, like, some random stuff, I don't really care, I don't want, I don't wanna, I don't care about surviving, I just care about, you know, Actually, wait, I do care about surviving. What the flip am I doing? What, what am I saying? I have to survive as long as possible, so I'm just gonna keep- I'm gonna take some territory away from some countries so I can also get myself some land. Let's, fi let's finish you fellas off real quick. My army is weak as hell, but I doesn't think I'm gonna be able to- Actually, I'm gonna be able to annex the old Congo almost. Okay, well, Ethiopia just ruined everything. I, I need land as well, so um, thank you very much. You son of a gun. Oh, come on, bro. Not now. Not now. Come on. It's not the time to play around right now. Oh, four frick. Oh, this is a problem. Jesus Christ, you know, I might actually bump up the difficulty to legendary mode, actually. That's gonna be quite crazy. Obviously, I don't wanna... I mean, I wanna do that to see how strong the countries are gonna be. And I was also thinking about doing a video on that as well, just, you know, for the fun of it, so... Oh, for frick, bro, come on. I'm losing money, I don't really care, honestly. It's like we're not doing too well right now, are we? The game is really lagging, but it's already been eight minutes. Okay, let's just peace out with you first. Uh, peace negotiations. Thank you for your stupid goddamn land. Oh my god. See, so I guess I guess we. Oh, and so oh, I just uh, hit my mic. Okay, I guess. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I haven't planned this out really well, have I? I think I might have to uh, change up a little bit the plan here. But I'll see you guys in just a second, and oh my god, what the hell is going on here? I'm back, and I made a decision that we have to at least invade a country before we uh, switch to a different one. Obviously, I don't want to go straight away and invade some countries. I want to, you know, let the world pick up some action before we do that, just so it makes it more fun and crazy. But yeah, once again, they have Christmas, so I'm going to be on maximum. But this time, the difficulty is going to be bumped up to legendary, so... Um, yeah, either we invade a country... I, okay, there's two rules, actually. Either we invade a country, then we can we can back out and switch to a different one. Or we just try to survive as long as possible, and if we die, we have to switch. So that's pretty much it. So yeah, the, the difficulty is going to be on legendary mode. A aggression is on 400, on 400. And we have five switches, so here we go. Okay, Thailand. Uh, that country. Or Romania could be good, actually. Bosnia, Austria. Okay, Austria is actually quite well good. Uh, not a bad country. I did want to be Germany though. Let's see what happens if I skip forward. Let's see. Yep. Instant troops pop up out of nowhere. All right, let's do some. We want to put like a lot of this and uh, and a lot of that. We'll do aid and administration, aid and that, and then we'll just do like. Yeah, we'll do most of it in research. So we have a decent amount of stuff happening here. 
Goods we can lower them back down. Taxes can go up very high over here, and that's about fine. Their investments can go. Oh shoot! And we'll call in a bunch of freaking research. Actually, no, we want us to gain some money, so we also want to gain some research points as well. That might help. By the way, this is legendary mode, and already the Czechs have 1,000 troops. Yeah, as you can see, this is like this is no joke. These fellas are about to go to war as well, by the way, so this isn't just something like this. Um, let me do the economy growth for this one. I'm scared. I actually am scared. Um, I'm actually trying to survive as long as possible, actually. I think I'd rather do this with the video. And, and uh, how about... Can you see any other troops? Yeah, the countries have... Yeah, let this what legendary mode is like. Only the only like the top G's, only like the absolute like top G's that are out there in the world who play this game for hours and hours. And played it for probably five thousand hours. That those are the ones who can actually play legendary mode. For me, I I'm just a, just a boring piece of crap of a noob. So yeah, um Let's get a little more armies. Oh yeah, there you go. First war Czechoslovakia. Yeah. And there's a peace treaty. Okay. Oh, Hungary's over with Croatia. And what the hell is going on with the Swiss? And the French. Nice. Oh, Benilux is about to become one thing. Um, anything going on? Man, Serbia's invading Bulgaria. Greece that we're with Romania. Albania's invading. Okay, Macedonia's invading Albania. And uh, oh my. Okay, the rebel groups destroyed Turkey. Georgia's having to go at Russia right away. Russia's invading China and India, and then, yeah, the legendary mode is, is quite crazy. This is, I was not expecting this. Venezuela looks actually, actually quite cursed, I don't know what to say. Oh my god, the amount of lag, holy frick. Whoa, 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 okay, game, relax, please. How long am I going to be able to, can I even invade some country, like, I'm going to try to invade someone. I like how this cost a ton crap of money. I'm not getting any research, am I? Yeah, my military is okay. Let's do a little bit more. Ah, because my research is freaking down. Yeah, my research is completely trash. Uh, let's do let's do a little bit more benefit on the goods. Taxes can stay like that, and then you guys can just stay at twenty. Actually, you guys can go back to twenty. Just about there. I'm probably gonna get wiped out instantly of the map because I'm a very small country, and then, and then Germany's probably gonna haunch this me. So it's just something I don't want to do right now. Something I don't want to deal with. I don't want to get haunched this right now. I wanna. Oh my god, there's so much fucking lag, bro. Um. Oh, what the hell, Ukraine? Okay. Yeah, Bulgaria is winning the war, and then. Russia is still fighting Georgia, surprisingly, and then oh my God, Belarus. How strong is the British? Well, I almost got ten thousand troops because the British always sit around and they hold Ireland. Belgium is invading the French. That's something you never see. And then the U.S. that war with Canada again. Um, these guys are at war. Peru, Bolivian Confederation is going to become one thing at some point, and let's go back hold on. I hope no one invades Slovenia, because I will have to take over and invade this myself, so, uh... And I that's one country down. You know, actually we need to invade probably one more, or we can try to survive. At least we invade some, no, somebody. Uh, let's let's uh, go back into Austrian territory. I'm waiting for someone to declare war on me and see if I can... Oh yeah, I can also... I... Oh, I imagine... Oh, this actually gave me an idea. We can probably one day try to form one of these bad boys with, like, aggressive mode on. It's gonna be quite tough. I'm not gonna lie, it's gonna be quite tough. Oh, man. I'm bad. This is what the challenge videos for today. Just plays a random country, trying to survive or invade a country or two. And see what. Oh, Germany, I'm sorry, but this time you're not gonna be able to get the state in land. Just ain't gonna work. This isn't really working out as a utility work. 
turn that crap off. That maximum difficulty. We'll turn the game speed to 120. See what country we can get. Estonia? Yeah, no thank you. Sudan? No, and then... Okay, New Zealand. New Zealand is okay, actually. Uh, okay, yeah, that's pretty good. Let's do some economy growth. Income taxation and income production. Administration, we'll do that as well for like 10. Military upkeep, 5, and then the rest can go into research. Uh, let's, try to, let's try to build an army. Oh yeah, we can also... Oh yeah, from United States of the Oceania. That's the that's, I can... Well, um, yeah, that's never gonna happen anytime soon when I'm playing this challenge. This challenge is not gonna make it easy. And uh, yeah, I'm the 72 strongest country. Uh, let's just... Um, come on, our taxes can go up. Sorry, fellas. Taxes are very low in New Zealand. I don't know if this is like real life. Uh, is it the same as in real life? I don't think so. Um, yeah, screw the research for now. We don't want to, we don't care about the research. Um, I'd imagine one day that New Zealand's probably gonna break apart into like South New Zealand and like, like probably South Zealand and North Zealand, sort of being New Zealand. You'll probably just like break up into like two separate uh, countries, like this is like the Republican, this is like the Democratic one, or whatever. Or, well, you know, I'm just. I mean, it's possible, you never know. I can actually, I can all, I'm, I really want to make my own map, but I just don't know how to do that yet. I know I make my own map and then we can actually, I can actually use that for many videos. So can China form the Qing Dynasty? I don't think they would, but then, yeah, Japan is trying to invade Russia. And then, uh, yeah, Spain's fighting Portugal. Imagine Portugal wins, that would be quite embarrassing for Spain. Russia's still fighting the Ukrainians because, you know, Ukrainians are just completely OP and they're like top Gs and why not, so. Ukrainian is never gonna die, alright? Ukrainian is just too strong. And for some reason, the Italians just uh, Anschluss Austria. That, that's, that's, that's something. The Czechs are about to pull a reverse card on Germany, that's even awesome. Denmark completely just got ignored, and then Poland's just forming their old claims. Yeah, and Moldova's also fighting Ukraine, I think, or Russia. Oh! Oh, yeah, there's a peace treaty. Um, I was about to say Palooper Berlin Confederation, but that didn't work out. Uh, what else? Oh yeah, that was a very dumb idea. Why did I make Russia form the Soviet Union? I should have never done that. All right, let's go back to our country because we just forgot about we just forgot our existence completely. So we can go back and oh yeah, right. We need to recruit a huge freaking army, and I'm out of money. All right, you know what? Let's just go invade some small. Let's try and invade Australia. This is the fun of it, see how long we can last. Well, that was a complete fail. Oh, we didn't last 10, but we didn't last. Oh, yeah, never mind, that's 12,000 troops. Yeah, see, I'm, I'm pulling the reverse card on these fellas. This is what always happens to me in every video, so I'm doing the exact same crap. I'm also gonna try to... Well, frick. Well, I'm dead. Let's see. Ukraine, Madagascar, Iran, Central African Republic, and the U.S. Oh, yes! This is a good start. This is a very good start. We're playing as the U.S. Playing as the big boy USA. We'll put like. I'll well, we'll put the rest in the administration. Screw it. Good news for the mod. Yeah, every time I play as the US, you also get this. Uh, you also you get these events. You don't always get this with every country. This mod also has events, but it's just extremely rare. You don't see them. I'm I'm earning a crap ton of money right now. Like I'm gonna be rich, which means I can actually invade Mexico next. 
I mean, actually, we we can invade Mexico, do a little bit of a mini war here, or just throw do a throwback at the American Empire thing when I did it a while back. It's already been half an hour. I'm already enjoying myself. I'm really having fun with this. We need more troops. All right, you fellas, it's time to deploy you at the Mexican border because we need to invade these fellas. So yeah, we'll just deploy a very small army. And I think I'm gonna run out of fellas here to invade. Oh yeah, definitely, I'm gonna run out of troops. Yeah, I think I might be out yeah, of troops. Freaking awesome. There's no problem because we can recruit some more. Never mind, we can't because we're running low on crap. And the game is like a yes, so. Come on. You slow fellas, come on. Oh, Canada! No, no, dude, this is the wrong time, no. The Canadians really- oh yeah, that's 6,000 troops, alright. Alright, we need- no more- no more invading Mexico, retreat, alright? We need to beat the Canadians in the face. Just, just send it around, I don't care, just send these guys everywhere. We need to go protect the Washington, because that's the most important part of the- important part of the country. You guys can go to New York City and well New York I should say. You guys can go all the way over here to Maine. Yeah, I'm gonna die extremely quick. Holy frick! No please! Then take over all New York by the way, so um I'm being completely invaded in the east right now. Don't you dare even take don't take over the capital please. Oh, this is a very good start. I really, I actually, oh, I think it was Maine. We're about to make a landing anyway. I think it was the capital, Washington. Canada's really aggressive right now. Please, Canadians, I throw buddies, I throw friends, and you can just. Why you gotta do this to me? Okay, there you go. We got some troops. Where the rest of the army? What the flip? We're fighting back, sort of. Well, I want to try something. Can I actually protect only the one area? I want to... Frick. Yeah, I'm, I'm dead. I want to try something. And that is... God dang it, dude. I want to see if I can actually protect only one province. I'm, I'm very curious. Can I protect only one province? Come on, fellas, retreat. Go back to Washington. Flip. Yeah, well, this is a complete disaster. I'm completely dead here. Hey, Mexico, can I need a little bit of backup from you, please? Hey, Mexico, please. I can't even have time. God dang it, dude. Hey, Mexico, could you... Um... Oh, yeah, I forgot again. Dang it. And people are getting mad. Nice. Well, water can start to... What a, what a good last start for the video. Is, there, is anyone gonna help me? You know what, I surrender. Uh, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, make sure you subscribe to the channel, click the bell, share the video, like the video, and see you next video.